See you next year, Sydney. Hello, all you wonderful, beautiful people. Welcome back to the video. The dreaded day has come. It is finally here. As we say in Dutch, there is a tide from komen and there is a tide from gaan, which means there is a time to come and there is a time to go. And my time to leave has arrived. I cannot thank Cindy enough for this beautiful, magical place that she opened up to me. And she let us stay six and a half weeks in this spot. So if you want to go and volunteer in Portugal in a beautiful spot, get a sense of the community, meet new people, have lots of fun on her farm, have the freedom to interpret things you want to do and make everything a little bit more beautiful as you're here, please contact Cindy Vine. Go help her out. Cindy and I have had so much fun here and we've gotten so many things done. I cleaned out the shed. I cleaned out her kitchen, made it a little bit more beautiful. I grouted the floor. I grouted some of the bathroom floor. I <laughs> took care of her uh, house, her, her bedroom, her cottage, her living room area. And I made a gate and I helped with fencing. I helped with little piggies that were born. I helped when little Molly was born. So many things happened. There's never a dull moment working on a farm. Now I'm leaving Cindy with her farm. And even though I had so much fun being here and I will absolutely miss it. It is now time for me to continue on our journey because we have to be back in the Netherlands by the half of May. So it is time for us to continue on our journey. Look at little baby Molly, you guys. She is the cutest thing in the world. And I've also discussed with Sydney we will probably meet up in October in the Netherlands because she will be there for working and I will go and pick her up and show her around the town. And we, I will probably come back here next winter if I travel again to Portugal because I am going to miss the farm. I'm going to miss all the people and I think I would love to hang out a month or two with her again because her farm is just a wonderful magical place and she has so many wonderful things she still wants to get done and I would love to be a person in her life making her achieve all the goals that she has for her beautiful farm. Now I'm not only going to miss Cindy, I'm going to miss all of the cute animals and in particular this little baby here, little Molly, who was born while I was house sitting and she is gro grown to be such a little mischievous, or mischievous little lamb. She's doing great and here are all my little piggy friends. Now we've actually lived in this spot for six and a half weeks and before I'm gonna leave it is time to check if little Sophie which is the name of my van is doing good so I'm checking the oil which was great I'm checking the, the breaker fluid and the, the cooling fluid and the only thing that I need to put a little bit with a little bit water in was the windshield fluid and then she's all done so we can leave again The surroundings of Cindy's farm are absolutely beautiful. The village is super cute. People are very friendly and this river is magical. So I 10 out of 10 recommend if you need a safe place to land for a little while, go visit Cindy. It is magical here. It's in his property and we just 
It's the end of the day. We just walked all the way down there. Because if you go off of Cindy's property to the left, and you just continue down, you get to a little river. I'd seen that on the map, and before I got here, I thought, oh, when we're here, we're gonna do that. And we hadn't done it. And I was talking to my mom, I said, oh, I forgot to go to the river. And she was like, go down there, go do it. So we walked down, but the thing is, now we have to go, the bit way back is all up, but so beautiful. So many flowers in the river, it's absolutely stunning. And there's a lot of traces of boar here, so don't go here in the evenings, guys. But uh, yeah, it's so awesome. Let's go make our way back. See you next year, Sydney. Yeah, my aunt is telling me next. I'll see you in October. Oh yeah, I'll October. see you in October. <laughs> okay. Bye. So it's the end of the day. I just said goodbye to Sydney. I'm leaving tomorrow, but she's leaving tonight. It's in the middle of the night. She's going back to the airplane to go and do her worky things abroad. And we're gonna hang out here for one last night, enjoy the silence, the tranquility, the beauty, enjoy all of it for a warmer evening, a warmer night. And then tomorrow morning, it's off to Newfoundland Adventures, everyone. Hope we're gonna have so much fun. I think we'll have so much fun. And it's just a switch. I need to make a little switch. Like when I went here, I knew I was gonna go to see this place. So I was driving and then I decided to go like to the south. And then I went to the Algarve, and then after a while I was like, it's time to go to Sydney. And now we're here, so now it's time to get back. Sydney's just gonna drive past, wave at her one more time. And then that's the end of it, guys. It's the end of my time at the farm. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching my video. We are off to New Adventures. I will see you in the next one. And in the meantime, don't forget to say yes to New Adventures.